Okay, I'm starting my workout at the office. Um, it's also the first day of my chemotherapy treatment for SLL lymphoma, which is not the worst lymphoma. It's a good lymphoma, you know, if you can say that, but it, it, uh, it's treatable, it's very treatable. And I started my, my treatment infusion therapy today. It lasted six hours. I did it at Sutter. Oh, by the way, this is this stuff is squamous. It's not. Um, it's not SLL. It's not lymphoma related. Um, and I was there six hours. I used to pour it. I don't want to gross you out, but I want you to see how this works. My workout is normally about 20 sets of stairs, five each, 100 flights. So I'm going to do half of that today. And I'm doing this because I want to document how it, this treatment affects me throughout the course of it, particularly for cycling, which I'm not starting now because the port's still a little sensitive. Um, but I intend to cycle throughout the, the U.S. this summer, um, like in May, June, July. The treatment's over in August. My big trip is to the Asir Mountains in South Saudi Arabia. You probably wonder why would you do that after being saved by cancer treatment. But the whole point is to go document super hard climbs that we do globally. All right, we get another click here. And I plan on doing a workout regimen throughout my treatment that is designed to get me up 12 of the hardest climbs in Saudi Arabia, including the second most difficult. And I'm gonna use all resources I can, the nutritionist, etc. Taylor Hockett, who does our nutrition and training blog, will be you know invaluable to me. I'm gonna eat well, I'm going in to Kaiser to get nutrition um, tips and guidance, education. I already have a lot of experience in that, but I figured this is pretty specific, so I'm gonna go do that. And I'm going to train. I'll start getting back on the bike soon, but I just got the port put in and, you know, it's my first day uh, of chemo, so I didn't want to push it. But anyway, I, this video, I hope to be a guidepost to some extent for others that are going through the same or similar circumstances as I am. And I hope that I can do well with the training and all the work that I put in for it and Sutter's great health and technology medicine the way it's advanced and I hope uh, I hope this can be of some good to someone or individuals uh, at some point in the near future and please contact me um, if you're going through anything similar to this because I really enjoy the community that we have with PGM Cycling and this is a subset of it is a very important subset to me and I'm certain to other cyclists and their families and friends.